Prosecutors spent a lot of time with Michael Lillibo today. He's from the state fire marshal's office, and Lillibo explained the pictures that were taken that night of the deadly fire. Is there anything in particular in these photographs that, that stood out to you? The fire pattern. Lillibo said that the pictures show this fire was intentional and that the forensic evidence supports that. And to have a fire spread to those vehicles that early on as we saw in the video of the first arriving fire truck, it, it doesn't make sense. Then it was time for Patrick Thompson's attorneys to ask Lillibo questions. They pointed out that fire investigations evolve through time. You've stated several times this was incendiary and consistent with ignitable liquid, right? Yes. You cannot identify where that liquid was placed. The defense said Lillibo can't definitively say what caused the fire last May and that there are other factors at play, like the fact that one of the people who lived at the X-Line home smoked on the porch. The careless disposal of smoking material anywhere on that porch, it doesn't explain what you see in that video, that wall of fire. Lillibo stood by his testimony saying that through evidence and investigation and his knowledge of fires that he believes this one in Guthrie Center was set intentionally. In Albia, Erica Rankin, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa.